I got into technology when I was in like maybe like seventh grade. Um, we didn't have computers in my school. I saw a truck pull up with all these computers and stuff like that. I guess somebody had donated them to the school. And we even had a new computer teacher and everything like that. So um, they started a computer club and you get to stay after, play games and learn about setting up an email address. Little stuff that, you know, made it seem like it was a big deal, you know, setting up an email address. But yeah, that's ever since that day, I think I was into it. So tell me about Played. So Played is what exactly? Well, Played is... Uh, it's going to be a social network for gamers on your mobile, you know. The way I see it is I like to talk about games so much that I wanted to create a, a, a streamlined word of mouth channel where we can share what we're playing, you know, no matter what platform you're using, whether iPhone, PlayStation, 360, whatever, you know, share what you're playing and also get recommendations for what you should play next. I always felt that word of mouth was, you know, the biggest thing that made me want to go buy a game. I didn't buy a game unless, you know, my brother or my friend would tell me, hey, you know, this is a cool game. But, you know, now it's actually a fact. It's really a statistic that most games are bought by word of mouth. So the industry is getting bigger, you know. It's a $70 billion industry by 2015. It's already, like, 60 like million types of apps or whatever you know no matter what you do is games coming out every second and with the tools you know of today it's easier for anybody to create a game so all these games are coming out so people are talking it's a lot of white noise and what I want to do is just take the white noise away Do will you play. move out here I mean can you go back to Newark where there's not that much support and not that much infrastructure for funding people who are passionate about games and gamers? I will probably move out here, to tell the truth. Um, but that doesn't mean that I won't go back to, you know, Montclair or Newark and, um, you know, and, and give back, you know, and bring some resources and let them know how it is and how to do whatever I did. Um, I definitely won't abandon them because if I do, then how can I talk to the younger version of me, you know? So I'm just looking. Um, that's the one thing I want to do. You know, I saw an interview with, uh, I think it was Will Smith not too long ago. He's like, you need to become an idea, you know? So, and, and I never understood that until I was out here because I was thinking about, you know, my younger self. And I never had the idea of a black entrepreneur or a black tech entrepreneur, but now I do. So I want to give the idea to somebody else.